In the vast, deep forest of Hyrule, long have I served as the guardian spirit. I am known as the Deku Tree. The children of the forest, the Kokiri, live here with me. Each Kokiri has his or her own guardian fairy. However, there is one boy who does not have a fairy. Navi, Navi, where art thou? Come hither. O oh, Navi the fairy, listen to my words, the words of the Deku tree. Dost thou sense it, the climate of evil descending upon this realm? Malevolent forces even now are mustering to attack our land of Hyrule. For so long, the Kokiri forest, the source of life, has stood as a barrier, deterring outsiders and maintaining the order of the world. But, before this tremendous evil power, even my power is as nothing. It seems the time has come for the boy without a fairy to begin his journey. The youth whose destiny it is to lead Hyrule to a path of justice and truth. Navi, go now. Find our young friend and guide him to me. I do not have much time left. Fly, Navi, fly. The fate of the forest, nay, the world depends upon thee. Hello, Link. Wake up. The great Deku Tree wants to talk to you. Link, get up. Hey, come on. Can Hyrule's destiny really depend on such a lazy boy? You finally woke up. I'm Navi the Fairy. The great Deku Tree asked me to be your partner from now on. Nice to meet you. The great Deku Tree has summoned you, so let's get going right now. Alright, the cutscenes are finally over. Hey, this is the Shadow Mantis, and welcome to my next Let's Play, Le The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. I kind of messed up right there. Yahoo! Hi, Link! Alright, so let's go talk to this girl right here. <gasps> wow, a fairy! Finally, a fairy came to you, Link. Wow, that's great news. I'm so happy for you. Now you're a true Kokiri, Link. Is that right? The Great Deku Tree has summoned you. It's quite an honor to talk to the Great Deku Tree. I'll wait for you here. Get going. Go see the Great Deku Tree. So that is Saria. Um, we'll get into her later. Uh, but right now I just want to kind of talk about this game. This is Mido. He won't let you through to see the Great Deku Tree, because you don't have the right equipment. You're not a real man. 
he wants to see a sword and shield before he lets you through. So that's our quest right now, get a sword and get a shield. But right now I kind of wanted to talk about, you know, the start of this Let's Play. You know, why I chose this game, and uh, really why, why it's so late. It's been a long time since I uploaded a video, you know, an actual Let's Play video. Um, I, I really wanted to do this, this game as a uh, Let's Play for a long, long time. It was probably, uh, easily one of the, just, I really, really wanted to play this eventually on my channel when I started it. I knew that I was eventually going to play this game because it was the first, first of all, it was the Legend of Zelda game. It was the first one I beat. It was the first one, one of the first ones I played, other than Wind Waker, and I didn't beat that until like, maybe six, seven years ago, which is actually a pretty long time ago, but let's not get into that. This was the first Legend of Zelda game I beat. It's the one that I feel I connect with the most. Not not my favorite, but uh, it's definitely one of the better ones for me. So I felt, you know what? I, I'll give it justice. I'll I'll return to it what it has given to me. Um, and I decided to make a a well a well created, well hopefully a well created let's play of this game where I get everything in the game. All 100 gold Skulltula coins, all, um, I think it's 24 heart pieces, I'm pretty sure it's 24. And just, oh, oh, okay, boulder, alright, um, oh, 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 no, oh, oh, alright, alright, I think we're fine now, uh, hopefully. So right now we have a sword, let me go equip that. Uh, now all we need is a, a shield, and we can go see the Great Deku Tree. Now, we are going to need another 20 rupees, which is the currency of Zelda, to get a shield. You buy the shield at a shop, and I guess I'm just going to have to slash a couple of these to get rupees. So yeah, I really, really wanted to play this game since whenever I started my channel. But I knew, like, at the beginning that I wouldn't be able to, because, you know, I was, I was, a, I was not the greatest Let's Player at that time. So let's jump across this for five rupees, and then this person here will talk to us. Hi, Link, look this way. Look over here with the Z button. And, uh, so this is the first instance of Z targeting, or Z targeting, I, I don't care what you call it. It's basically, you can use your fairy to uh, lock on to stuff. Navi locks on to stuff while pressing the Z, Z button, whatever you want to call it. So that that is probably one of the best features of this game. It's not really that great, like it's not done well, but Z, Z targeting was the best idea. Like, I don't know how to get into it. So I won't at the moment, but I'll get into it later, hopefully, since I said it. But uh, now let's get into really why this game is... It's been a while since I uploaded, if you noticed. And that's really because I had the flu for a week. And then I had two canker sores, and I really couldn't commentate at all. I tried, and it just didn't work. So. If you don't know what a canker sore is, think of a crater in the earth. But instead of in the earth, it's in your mouth. If you know what I mean, and it hurts. It hurts. It's probably one of the most painful things I've ever felt. It it really hurts. So I, I couldn't talk basically normally for a week. Uh, we just got uh, enough rupees, so now let's go get that shield. Alright, so just talk to this guy and buy the shield from him. It's only 40 rupees. No, no, buy it. And, uh, let's go talk to Mido. And, uh, get into the Deku Tree's 
little, I guess, orchard he has there. No, I don't want to buy anything else with my eight rupees that wouldn't be able to buy anything. Let's just swim over there. You can swim in this game. And, uh, that's the start of a couple of problems, if you know what I mean. If you want to pass through here, you should at least equip a sword and shield. Oh, I don't have the, the shield equipped. How stupid of me. So there we go. If you want to see the Great Deku Tree, you should at least equip a sword and shield. Hey, what's that? Oh, you have a Deku shield. What's that? Is that the Kukiri sword? Good grief. Well, even with all that stuff, a wimp is still a wimp, huh? Shoot, how did you become the favorite of Saria and the Great Deku Tree, huh? Grumble, grumble. Well, I'm just that great. And here is the first enemy you will see in the game, the Deku Baba. He will give you a Deku Stick if you kill him. Only the straight ones right here that, like, don't bend around and stuff. I won't even get into that because it's too complicated. But here we are at the Great Deku Tree's little shrine area. Great Deku Tree, I'm back! O oh, Navi, thou hast returned. Link, welcome. Listen carefully to what I, the Deku Tree, am about to tell thee. Thy slumber these past moons has been restless and full of nightmares. As the servants of evil gain strength, a vile climate pervades the land and causes nightmares to those sensitive to it. Verily, thou hast house. Thou hast felt it. Jeez, I just got mixed up with my words. Link, the time has come to test thy courage. Dost thou have courage enough to undertake this task? Yeah, I, uh, might have skipped over a bit of text right there. Then enter, brave Link, and thou too, Navi. Navi the fairy, thou must aid Link. And Link, when Navi speaks, use the up arrow button to listen well to her words of win wisdom. So, the text I accidentally skipped through was uh, basically, the Deku Tree has a curse. See, you can tell because he's not looking too great. I mean, you know he's not looking too great when his eyes and his mustache look the exact same. So, in the next episode, we will actually be entering the Great Deku Tree. So thanks for watching, and I hope to see you then. Goodbye.